Hey everyone, Lula Rose, Stevie Page, um, and today we are going to show you different ways to style your Julia dress. Um, I will say the first time I interacted with the Julia dress, I didn't like it. Um, I was a little intimidated by the form fitting, but I will say that I've worn it several times and I've gotten compliments and um, have grown to love it. It has actually become my favorite dress that Lula Rose has to offer. Um, the Julia dress is a t-shirt style dress. Um, it is mid-length sleeves, scoop neck, form fitting, and goes about to your knee or a little bit longer. Um, I am typically a small to medium bottom at retail stores, um, but can wear a extra small, small Lula row Julia dress. Um, my favorite way you will hear my tin mutt going in the background, I'm sorry. My favorite way to wear the Julia dress, just because I feel more comfortable, is to pull it up and do some ruching. Um, again, favorite way to wear the Julia dress. I, I tend to wear this one a lot with chucks um, or can dress it up with some cute wedges. Um, I love how versatile the Julia dress is. Another way that you can wear the Julia dress is actually with any of Lula Rose's skirts. I have the maxi skirt with me today. Um, and because it is form fitting, you can just put the skirt right over, and pull it down, and it looks like you have a nice top with your skirt. You can do the maxi skirt with the jewelry. You can do the Cassie skirt, which is like a pencil skirt, which is like the bottom half of this uh, dress. Uh, the Lucy Lola, any of the skirts that Lula has to offer, you can put over your um, Julia dress. Awesome way to mix patterns, um, to maybe tone down your pattern Julia dress with a solid skirt or spice up your um, solid Julia with a patterned skirt. Another way that I um, enjoy wearing the Julia dress is actually um, as a tunic. If you have not interacted with Lula Rose leggings or felt them or own a pair, you're missing out. Um, when they say buttery soft, they really are buttery soft. Um, I thought leggings are leggings, how can they be any different? But they really are. I'll try to do this without giving y'all a show. The material of LuLaRoe leggings is um, extremely soft and comfortable. So you can wear it with a cute pattern leggings, either long, like this. Um, I don't do this often, it's not my favorite. Um, I tend to wear it as a tunic. And the way you do that is you literally just grab where you want it to go. Pull up your Julia dress and fold it over. The nice thing about the Julia dress is that because it is form fitting, it doesn't even show that it is folded, which I love. Again, I tend to do some ruching just because I feel more comfortable. But this is wearing the Julia dress as a tunic. Let me try to take them off without giving you a show. The leggings aren't typically that difficult to get on and off. It's only because I'm trying to stay modest while doing it. The last way that I'm going to show you today how to wear your Julia dress is, actually I'm going to size up. This is a small, the one I have on is an extra small. Um, and just for the sake of the video, I'm going to put it over top of this dress. I don't ever wear it like this, but to show you. I can wear a small, and it's just a little bit more baggier. Um, not as extremely form-fitting, which, again, I love. Um, as you can see, it's a little baggier and a little bit longer. I will wear this a lot of times um, 
with some wedges or my um, flats or some cute little tennis shoes, flats. Again, I tend to always do a little bit of ruching whenever I'm just wearing just the Joya. You can do that. So. Um, this has quickly become one of my favorite ways to wear the Joya dress. Uh, you want to size up when you're doing this one. It's kind of hard to do with one that's extremely tight. But you need a little belt. Sorry. Here. Um, you're going to put your belt on. And I, just to get the strap hidden, pull your dress up. And fold it over the belt. I have actually worn this several times this week, like this. I love doing the joint dress like this. It's super comfortable. Kind of looks like two layers, and you don't even see that belt. I would suggest the thin belt as well. You're getting comfortable. I, again, typically don't have the other dress on underneath, so it's more giving normally. But um, We have shown you several ways to wear your Julia dress. Um, another nice feature that I want to plug in about the Julia dress is that it is great if you are pregnant um, because it does have a little bit of give in the stomach. It allows for it to grow with your tummy, um, but still stay long, which is really nice. That was an issue I had finding dresses that would fit, but keep the length um, as I was pregnant. So definitely try out a Julia dress for that reason. Um, I hope you were able to find a style that you like um, and will try with your Julia dress. If you don't currently own a Julia dress and are looking for one, um, you can check us out at Lula Rose TV page. Um, we sell on Facebook and Periscope, um, or you can contact us at Page at gmail.com. Um, please subscribe to our videos. We plan to do um, plenty more styling tips as well as share about our experiences being a consultant. Uh, thank you all, and have a good day. Bye.